Well, let's get back to Walmart for a moment because Yahoo Finance's Julie LaRoche sat down with Sam's Club CEO, John Ferner. I'm here with Sam's Club CEO, John Ferner. Thank you so much for joining sure. us. Sure. Good morning, Julia. So there is a transformation that has been going on at Sam's Club. This is one of those undertold stories in the broader Walmart ecosystem. Walk us through, what are you guys doing inside Sam's Club? Well, uh, first of all, thanks for taking the time, and it's a great story. We're working on a number of things, but primarily we've really focused in on a target member, and we've talked about who the member is for the last couple of years, and we've been working on innovation and building technology and applications to help us serve the target member in ways that they haven't been served before. All right, who is that tar target member and how are they doing? Sure, so the target member, it's uh, typically a homeowner that earns from about 75 to 125,000 a year, so middle class in the United States. It's a growing segment, we're growing with them, and we've been working on the right portfolio of, categ of categories, products, and tools to make it easier for them to shop with us. Can you give us some examples? Sure, one that we just talked about on the stage is, is Scanago, and Scanago okay. lets you bypass the line, and we're about to add barcodeless scanning to that where you can just look at the product with your camera, it'll load it your cart, uh, but we also do club pickup, um, we've got better exit technology, and then we're working on several things that'll help predict how you shop and make things simpler. Okay, so I know you all were also uh, testing Sam's Club now uh, in now. Texas. Give us an update there. How is that going and, and how do you see that kind of expanding in the future? Well, what we're using Sam's Club now for is a test lab for technology and processes. And we've got a number of things that we have already tried in Sam's Club now that now have now expanded across the country. So what it's doing is it's making our jobs easier for our entire workforce and then it's making shopping easier for our members. You know, an example is you, in the future, because of Sam's Club now, you'll be able to use Scan and Go to buy beer and wine and other categories that you couldn't buy before. But it's making things quicker, and it's also teaching us how to be really efficient. Okay, so you've been with this company a long time, going back to your college days. That's right. I just have to ask you, um, because there's a lot of conversations about change, what's been one of the changes that surprised you mm -hmm. the most in your career? Um, there always are changes, and uh, I think what I'd say about change is it's, it's easy to talk about, but it's hard to do uh, because it affects the way people work, it affects the way people shop. And just this shift in the last couple of years to Omni has, has really come pretty quickly. Um, I spent a year, few years living in Asia and saw it happen there, and it's now happening here. But, you know, where would you rather work than some, than some place that's got hundreds or thousands, in, in the case of Walmart U.S., up to uh, six or 5,000 locations that you can deliver from. Mm -hmm. And you guys are certainly making a lot of changes. You're also seeing your, your comps grow, your traffic grow. Uh, what do you attribute to that the most? Because you did make the decision recently to close some clubs, yet you're seeing the growth still in the ones that you still have. That's right. The narrowing the focus has really helped. We've been lowering prices in key categories and key markets all across the country. We've also narrowed our assortment down. One of the interesting things about wholesale club shopping is we curate. We narrow the assortment down so we make things easy. In a world where you're making a lot of decisions, everyone's strapped for time, and they're super busy, it's great to come into the club or shop online because we've narrowed the assortment to the point that it's really simple for you to shop. And one final question, because you are the CEO of Sam's Club, you guys have the rowdy cheering section we do. out there. We do. Uh, you've been at this company for a long, long time, so if you were going to give advice to someone in that audience who might be watching and one day fill your shoes, what would you say to them? That's right. Never, never underestimate how far you can go if you believe in yourself. This is a company that provides opportunity for people all over the world. I started working in a garden center in a parking lot, and I'm here today. So you can do anything that you set your mind to. Just stay with it. John Farner, CEO of Sam's Club, thank you so all much. Right, thanks, Julia. All right, so stay tuned right here on Yahoo Finance for our exclusive interview with Walmart CEO Doug McMillan. That's coming up later today.